On Heary's side, we're ahead on 14 minutes after a sweeping move and a quite magnificent ball with the outside of his right boot from Craig Walsh, which held up perfectly for Dinny Corcoran, who shot low into the bottom left-hand corner. Corcoran's second league goal of the season. The home side doubled their lead just before the half hour. A jinking run into the area by Paddy Cavanaugh was halted and the ball broke for Corcoran, who was upended by Shane Grimes, who then gave away a penalty. It was Corcoran who took the penalty himself and Julie sent draw to keeper Dave Ryan the wrong way. 2-0 to Bowes. Drogheda got back into the game on 35 minutes. Gary O'Neill chased a long ball over the top. Bowes defender Roberto Lopez made a fatal hesitation before realising it wasn't going out and O'Neill scored brilliantly from a very tight angle. Bohemians had chances to put this game to bed and Kavanaugh was guilty of a bad miss seven minutes to the second half when blazing over from the edge of the area. That and other misses by the home side proved costly as a minute from time, Drogheda forced a late corner. Bowes then failed to clear the subsequent dead ball and O'Neill pounced to the back post to force home the equaliser an entertaining 2-2 draw at Dalyman Park as O'Neill came back to haunt his former side. We were 2-0 up and there's probably little mistakes that cost us the game. Well, big mistakes that cost us the game. You know, the first mistake in the first half and a little drop the back in to get them a bit of momentum. Ourselves, we, we, uh, we should have seen out the game we were 2-0 up, but unfortunately we didn't. It'll probably be grey if we keep going on and playing like that and starting games like that because we haven't started the game yet, you know, so we could be very dangerous if we, if we get to start games.